this video I'm going to work out an individual integral problem. We've got the integral of tangent x to the fourth secant x squared dx. And I think for the most part this it turns out to be just a nice little u substitution. However, a lot of people struggle with exactly what they should let u be. All right. My suggestion is sometimes rewriting that original integral allows you to more easily see what you're going to have to let your u be. So if I rewrite that tangent x there, if I go tangent x and then I pull it out and write it as the fourth power like that, what that's going to allow you to do or see is that the inside function there is tangent tangent x. I've got four of them. All right. Well, if I take, what I'm doing is I'm looking for a u that when I take its derivative, it's going to cancel out something else in my integral. All right. And the derivative of tangent is secant squared. So hopefully rewriting that original one allows you to see what that u substitution is going to need to be. All right. So with that being said here, I'm going to let my u be tangent x and then taking the derivative of both sides, du equals secant squared x dx. If I go ahead and solve all the way down for dx, then I'm going to have a du over a secant squared x. Okay, that's going to allow me to do my substitution then. Okay, now coming back up and substituting from that original problem here. All right, I let u be tangent. So then I'm going to have a u to the fourth power. I'm going to keep the secant squared x. Replacing dx there with what I said it is, I'll be multiplying by a du over a secant squared x. Okay, that then is now going to allow me to cross out those secant squared x's. And then I'll be down to a nice little integral of u to the fourth du. And that then is something that's relatively easy to integrate. We're just going to add one and we'll have a one fifth u to the fifth plus c. And then replacing that u with what I originally said it was, which is going to be tangent. So then we'll have a one fifth tangent to the fifth plus c. Okay, so like I said, pretty straightforward as far as a u substitution goes. However, some people just really struggle with picking what that u is going to be. So sometimes rewriting it will definitely help. If the videos are helping you, be sure and share with your friends so it helps them as well. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.